Welcome to the Windows 8 channel and uh, this is a back to the basics video once again and its uh, purpose is to help you find a control panel in Windows 8. So one of the first things that we get in Windows 8 is the fact that when we uh, click on the uh, start button switches between you know desktop start menu or between apps desktop or app start menu and so on and one of the things that people don't find is the uh, control panel and even if you go into the charms bar you know you have settings but settings isn't exactly the control panel and so on and people just say well okay where is the control panel uh, there are a few ways to actually go there one of the easy one if you use the start screen is simply go to the search and type control panel and you'll have immediate access to the control panel which by the way is pretty much the same as Windows 7 or you can also if you use the desktop mode simply right click on the start button on the bottom left if you right click you'll see that in that list one of the options is control panel so few ways to actually access the control panel. Um, the control panel itself is pretty much the same as Windows 7. You have on the upper uh, right um, ways to change either by category view which gives you pretty much um, you know Windows 7, Windows 8 when you don't um, change anything by default is by category and you have the control panel like this. Um, if you're a uh, you know, long-time computer user like me, one thing that might be more interesting to you is probably to use the icon view and you have large and small icons and it gives you pretty much, you know, everything you have uh, in Windows. It's uh, close to the Windows 7. There are a few things that have changed, but not much. Um, I'd say you really, really have, you know, pretty much everything there, including the system tab where you can go into the, the um, device manager uh, you have access to um, you know many more options basically in Windows uh, 8.1 um, one of the things that Windows 8.1 control panel does not have is the you know where you can actually um, change the uh, lock screen and stuff like that that goes really really to the PC settings which is a different uh, thing and that's what I'll show in another video the PC settings um, is more like of a control panel that are for Windows uh, 8.1 specific items instead of being the regular down-to-earth Windows options that we usually have but remember that pretty much every options in the control panel are available through search. Search is very powerful in Windows 8 and using it is very, very good. For example, if you were looking for system or if you were looking for the device manager, you can actually just, you know, go into the charms, click search and just type either system and here it shows you you have the system settings. Uh, you have system down here which is the system that I just showed you not very long ago. Uh, another thing that you might uh, actually see is um, for example if you want device manager you just go and, and type device for device manager in the search you'll have the device manager show up. So these are all things that are easily available through search and uh, I can't stress enough that in Windows 8.1 uh, to use search as much as possible because it's very very uh, good at finding whatever you might be uh, searching inside of Windows itself so um, and if you want to really make you know a, a, a search that is more in the system you can change that for just settings and there you'll have if you say control panel only the things that are settings in the computer itself. So that's where the control panel is. It's quite easy. It's pretty much the same. This is where you'll have pretty much everything including the uh, programs and features to uninstall the program and uh, all of that. So uh, 
why not go and take a look at that in Windows 8.1. If you have any comments, questions, let us know. Maybe uh, you enjoy our videos. Why not subscribe? By subscribing, you will, of course, uh, have notifications of our new videos that we put online. We typically put videos online pretty much every week. And uh, if you have any questions, any comments, anything that maybe you'd like us to make a video of, let us know. I'll try to post that video online. But thanks for watching.